असतो मां सद्गमय तमसो मां ज्योतिर्गमय Lead us from bad to good from darkness to light Just as the light dispels darkness so does literacy dispel ignorance and light up the path of self development This desire to awaken to his motherland prompted one man Sri S Vishwanathan to establish a paper mill Sesha Sai Paper and Boards Limited SPB as popularly known in the industry SPB a company that produces fine papers creating lasting impressions has completed 6 decades of excellence as a trusted socially responsible and customer driven organization SPB was founded by Sri S Vishwanathan SV to his friends a freedom fighter who continued his fight even after 1947 for the country's economic freedom SPB is a signature of SV's beliefs. Over the last 6 decades, SPB conducts its business on the following principles which Sri SV believed as the role of the industry: serve the interests of larger sections of society, serve the cause of poverty alleviation, work for social upliftment. SPB Svin Group SPB is the flagship company of SPB Svin Group. The other group companies are Punni Sugars, a leading sugar mill in the state of Tamil Nadu, High Energy Batteries India Limited, a company that manufactures high performance batteries predominantly for the armed forces, SPB PC Limited, the consultancy arm of the group that provides project engineering consultancy in the areas of paper, sugar and ceramics industry. SPB Svin Advanced Technologies Limited a company that engages in basic and fundamental research in clean energy The genesis and the growth story of SPB The state of Madras now Tamil Nadu did not have any paper mill till the 1950s SPB at the request of the then state government was established as the first integrated paper mill in the state of Tamil Nadu in 1960 with a capacity to produce 20,000 tons of paper per annum in collaboration with Parsons and Whitmore USA under the dynamic leadership of Sri SV The government of Tamil Nadu participated in the equity capital of the company and till today remains a major shareholder The last 6 decades of SPB have been marked by periodic expansion cum modernization drive most of which under the leadership of sri n gopal ratnam who succeeded sv as the chairman of spb svin group of companies in the first decade ending 1970 capacity was expanded to 35000 tons per annum by upgradation of paper machine 2 and addition of paper machine 3 in the second decade ending 1980 capacity was expanded to 55000 tons per annum through addition of paper machine 4 in the third decade ending 1990 company took a key step in structuring its operations for use of bagasse which was seen as the most reliable source of fiber for the entire industry in 1984 the company promoted punni sugars and chemicals limited a sugar manufacturing unit as the captive source of bagasse supply Punni Sugars has today grown to become a leading sugar mill in the state. In the fourth decade ending 2000, the company embarked on a major expansion drive and increased its capacity from 55,000 tons per annum to 1,15,000 tons per annum by addition of paper machine 5 and by upgradation of some of the existing facilities. In the fifth decade ending 2010, SPB successfully set up a 21 megawatt captive power plant. In 2006, the company embarked on a major mill development program at a cost of 350 crore rupees to improve and sustain the environmental compliance performance of the company. 
The project envisaged total replacement of the existing wood pulping equipment of the mill with a 400 tons per day pulp mill sourced from USA, equipped with advanced technological feature like RDH pulping and installation of a new ECF line of chlorine-free bleaching, a modern chemical recovery boiler, a lime reburning kiln and a 16 megawatt turbo alternator set. This mill development plan 1 helped the E-Road unit of the company to be self-sufficient in pulp with in-house pulp completely replacing the costlier imported pulp. The sixth decade ending 2020 marked another chapter in SPB. SPB which until then had sought only organic growth opportunities drafted an ambitious inorganic growth plan through acquisition of a Sikh unit in Tirinalveli, Subburaj Papers Limited, which had a capacity of 72,000 tons, expandable to 90,000 tons per annum. The seventh decade has begun well for the company with successful completion of the MDP-3 plan in unit e -road. During the challenging years of COVID-19 pandemic, this MDP-3 project has helped the company to augment pulp capacity to 1,80,000 tons per annum and paper capacity to 1,65,000 tons per annum in its E-Road unit, besides enabling diversification to premium multi-layer boat segment. Growth Plans Acquisition of Assets of Sarvalakshmi Paper Limited The company has acquired the assets of Sarvalakshmi Paper Limited as a going concern, situated close to our existing Tirnalveli unit in an e-auction sale approved by Honorable NCLT. The company has taken over possession of the assets and is currently contesting the appeals in Honorable NCLAT, challenging the Honorable NCLT's order. The repair, refurbishment and upgradation of the plant and machinery of this unit is estimated to take a year's time after disposal of appeals in Honorable NCLAT. This unit can manufacture about 75,000 tons per annum of fine papers. MDP-4 The company is also currently taking steps to augment the pulp and paper production in unit E-Road by 20% and is seeking the environment clearance for the same. The six-decade history, backed by superior project execution skills and ably guided by the experience and expertise of eminent board of directors, had seen the capacity of the company growing over 10 times, from 20,000 tons per annum to over 2 lakh tons per annum. Environment-friendly manufacturing process the paper manufacturing process in SPB is environmentally friendly and green. SPB's process is energy efficient and elemental chlorine free. Innovative scheme of using treated water for sugarcane cultivation. SPB pioneered a unique innovative scheme for using its wastewater treated to surface discharge standards. Instead of letting it into the river, SPB diverts its treated water for the cultivation of sugarcane, transforming non-arable dry lands to wetland. Treated water is supplied free to local farmers for cultivation of sugarcane. The farmers in turn sell the sugarcane to Punni Sugars. Punni Sugars uses the sugarcane to produce sugar and supplies its byproduct bagasse to SPB. This unique model has transformed the livelihood of the local farming community. SPB structured lift irrigation project model has converted the surrounding dry lands into wetlands, thus providing a vast green belt. SPB has entered into a tripartite agreement with a local farmer society and its sister concern Punni Sugars e -road. Over 2,000 acres of dry lands have been converted into cultivable lands, 
providing livelihood to the farmers in the rural areas to whom this is lifeline. This innovative and successful model has been emulated by other industries. Tree Farming Program SPB helps farmers to grow trees. As part of its tree farming activity, the company provides quality clonal seedlings of eucalyptus and casuarina as well as bare-rooted casuarina seedlings at subsidized rates to farmers and also assists them with technical help to achieve higher yields and revenues. The company continues to be both wood and carbon positive. SPB's contribution to society and rural development. SPB has always strived to maintain itself as a company with a human face and a responsible corporate entity. True to the definition of corporate social responsibility, SPB is committed to contribute to economic development of the neighborhood while improving the quality of life of its stakeholders, the six-decade history is not only marked by ambitious capacity expansion projects, but also marked by ambitious social upliftment addressing rural development and poverty alleviation of the local community. SPB spares no effort in the professional development and training of its employees. As part of its employee welfare, SPB provides facilities such as housing quarters at heavily subsidized rates. SPB is actively and effectively involved in the social, economic and cultural development of the communities surrounding its production facilities. Awards, Accreditations Our company has bagged several awards for excellent environment performance, safety, energy efficiency, etc. Notable awards received by the company in recent years are CII Greenco Gold Rating Award during Greenco Summit held at Pune in the year 2017. Green Award 2017 by Tamil Nadu Pollution Control Board for Environment Protection CII National Award for Excellence in Energy Management Excellence in Energy Management for the past six consecutive years National Energy Leader, fourth time in a row Innovation Award Digester modification to enhance pulp production and green energy. Paper Mill of the Year Award for FY 2019-20 Awarded by Indian Paper Manufacturers Association. IPMA Energy Conservation Award for FY 2021-22 CII EHS Environmental Health and Safety Excellence Bronze Award for the year 2022 and later Silver Award for the year 2023 CII EHS Excellence Special Award in Energy Carbon Footprint for the year 2023 AEE Award Regional Corporate Energy Award 2021 by Association of Energy Engineers, U.S. Capexil Export Excellence Award for FY 2018-2022. SPB is certified under the Forest Stewardship Council, FSC. SPB has a long-standing record with ISO 9001, ISO 14001, and ISO 45001 accreditations. During the year, 
the company's secured certificate for the energy management system under standard ISO 50001-2018. Customer focus. The transparency and uniformity of SPB's marketing policies, combined with its dedication to service its customers, has earned SPB a niche place in the paper market, both domestic as well as overseas. SPB exports 15 to 20 percent of its production annually. SPB exports significant volumes to demanding markets like US, showcases the quality of SPB's products. Financial Performance SPB continues building on its current strengths and innovating its manufacturing process and management approach. SPB Tested by time and trusted by all will continue to maintain its name synonymous with fine papers creating lasting impressions.